All right, guys, welcome back to Joe's RT, RC Corner, and today we got a very special unboxing today, guys. Uh, my engine just arrived from Viking Aircraft Engines, and uh, man, they do a great job packing it, so uh, thank you guys for for that. And uh, what we're going to do is we're going to just start looking at a few parts. So I'm going to turn the camera around and let you guys see. Okay, guys, so here is the engine mount. Uh, I had them powder coated in the black. Uh, it's a little shinier than I was thinking, but... It's fine. I love it. I think it looks great and it's going to really look beautiful on the front end of that airplane. So thank you for getting that powder coated for me, Alyssa. I appreciate that. Oh man, look at that. There's my engine, guys. There's my Viking 130 and all the equipment that I need. Oh man, and my cow is right there. You guys do an amazing job packing everything into this box. Um, very, very impressed. Um, I'm going to start slowly pulling things out and uh, setting up. I'm going to set up my time lapse uh, to go through uh, pulling some of this stuff out of here. So uh, thank you guys. And uh, I'll uh, let you know when we get it all out. Okay, guys, I had to stop that time lapse for a second because the guys over at Viking, you guys are awesome. Um, I mean, how... How awesome is this that they personalize your uh, your package, <laughs> you know, with your engine this much? I mean, talk about customer service. You guys are so awesome. Um, I mean, so here here's the information on serial number, packing. Uh, they give you your wiring diagrams. Everything is laid out beautifully in this book. Um, dude, you guys are just... <laughs> You guys are awesome. I mean, they even give you a t-shirt, which I will be wearing with pride. Uh, that That's just, that's just great, man. You guys are so awesome. A hat, I will also be wearing that on some of my videos, guys. Uh, they give you the K&N filter. You got your oil and your... Uh, coolant overflows you have i mean this is just i mean you guys are just awesome i mean that's the ecu don't want to mess that up we'll set that off to the side your everything is just pre-filters everything is labeled beautifully i mean i got my dual throttles over here um the master relays I mean there's my nose block spacer um, and I will need to actually order big, uh, bigger bolts because uh, I made a mistake when I uh, drilled mine out I now instead of the A4s I have A5s in there so I'm going to have to drill this out to the A5 but uh, you know that's fine engine mounts uh, cooling, clamp rings, all these fit-ins, um, my starter and blocks, man, this is awesome, you guys are, you guys are awesome, man, so we're gonna go ahead and continue, and, uh, let's put the hat on, though. Okay, guys, so welcome back. Uh, so the time lapse is still going on. Uh, we're looking at some of the parts and stuff that came out. Man, they packed this up really nice. But here she is. Here is my Zenith, or my engine for the Cricket. This is the uh, Viking, uh, 130 horsepower. Uh, it is gear reduction. Um, and... They really strapped this sucker down. It did, it did not move at all. And, uh, man, look at that. That's gorgeous. I can't wait to get her in the airplane. And uh, I'm going to take you guys along for the ride doing all this. Um, yeah, this is, this is gorgeous. 
Um, so you have your engine mounts here that adapt to the standard mount. So you have your the original mount, it looks like. Oh, no, I'm sorry. That's an idler pulley for the belt. And you have your mount down here. You have a mount here. You have a mount here. And then one down over on this side. Um, and they really ratchet strap this down. Man, this is... This is great. All right. Got your throttle body over here. Throttle moves really nice and smooth. Very good. No damage uh, in the uh, transport. Um, I'm not sure. It was this... They're different. Am I missing something here? Uh, maybe that mounts to something else. I'll, I'll figure that out as I get to the uh, installation. But, uh, boy, she's beautiful. Um, and uh, I can't wait to get her in that. And, uh, again, I mentioned also this, the engine mount that they make up. Wow. That's all I can say is wow. The craftsmanship on this is, is absolutely gorgeous. I almost hate to drill into drill into it, but we gotta drill it to uh get it mounted, so wow. Alright guys, so as you can see I got my hat now. I got it fitting. And uh I'm uh looking forward to uh sharing the installation of this engine onto my uh my cruiser on my cruiser which is now uh dubbed the uh the cricket to be completely honest with you guys you can't get better customer service and personalized service than this if you guys are building an airplane if you're in the market for an engine check viking out these guys are great jan is very knowledgeable uh Alyssa is awesome with uh, customer service and uh i just i can't keep saying the nice nice enough stuff i mean i i really appreciate everything that they have been doing uh and uh getting this engine out to me um i'm really looking forward to getting this mounted as soon as i get my hanger and i get some of the stuff out of the uh, out of the garage one of my extra benches out of the garage here um we're gonna get this uh this engine mounted so first things first, I'm going to be working on getting that mount in. That way I can close up the firewall, get that all riveted in place. Once that's on, we're a step closer to getting the, uh, the engine on there. So uh, anyways, guys, that's where I'm going to sign off on this video. Uh, just wanted to do a quick uh, shout out to uh, Viking Aircraft Engines. I really appreciate all your support um, that you give to all of your customers, no matter what. And... I'm really looking forward to getting this uh, this built and uh, cleaned up, and yeah, it, it's. I think she's going to have awesome performance with this engine. So thank you, and uh, catch you guys on the next video. Keep building, keep flying, guys, and check out Viking engines. They're great. Bye now.